Mayor, I'm on the agenda scheduled matter tonight is Oakmont Apartments entrance sign located at 1 Oakmont Boulevard. The applicant Skylight Signs Incorporated is requesting sign approval associated with the installation of a 32 square foot freestanding entrance sign on a 41.69 acre parcel. Located in the MHR Medium High Density Residential District under Section 178.4 of the Code of the Town of Webster. Yes, sir. Good evening, Frank Three Skyway Signs, 60 Industrial Park Circle, Rochester, New York, uh, representing uh, Morgan Properties. Uh, we were here last month uh, discussing uh, a new sign for the new ownership of uh, the apartment complex. Uh, it was stated they were trying to, uh, you asked if they tried to reuse the uh, synthetic stucco monument that's there now. Um, we resubmitted a drawing, um, or they resubmitted drawings showing uh, a new uh, stone base. Um, you should have some revised drawings. Uh, I didn't know if the, we also, there was a narrative that was sent from the owner. Was that with your packet? Oh, I'm sorry? It's like a narrative just describing the, the, the revisions in that. <laughs> I can read some of it if you wish. Oh, yeah. page, uh, There's the uh, Oakmont Apartments Revised Signage Narrative. Yeah, well, I can read it to just get it in the right. You know, okay. Uh, like I said, this was written with uh, between Morgan and the actual manufacturer of uh, Pennsylvania that makes the sign. Do you have an extra I've got one right here, just one. Oh, okay, can I have one? Yes, oh, sure. This is what they wrote. <clears throat> it says, brief description of the applicant. The applicant Morgan Properties was founded in 1985 and owns and manages multiple family residential properties across uh, 10 states. Morgan Properties acquired Morgan Communities of Rochester, with no relation, in, in 2019. And the transition was involved over 80 properties in New York State with over 50 of them in the greater Rochester area. As a result uh, from the New York State acquisitions through the bankruptcy court, a, a significant investment has been made to refresh these properties, including the signage, so that there's no other indication of the former Morgan communities. Um, the, this is the signed description, revised the applicant request. The applicant understands that the previous uh, review meeting concerns were expressed about the design of the proposed post and panel style sign. That design matches other replacement signs that we've already, already done in the Webster communities at two other locations. The applicant understands that the board is looking for more of an architectural or masonry base, which is similar to other signs in the areas. The applicant has resubmitted a revised design with stacked stone masonry base. Uh, and, and appreciates the board's consideration of this revision. Uh, similar signs were done exactly the same way in, at the Regency and Victor Village apartments in Victor, New York. They also wanted to see a masonry base uh, and got rid of the post design. Uh, when the masonry is described in the monument sign, this design is a prototype that they've used at other locations. Uh, although the applicant does understand the board's preference, that the existing monument try to be reused and simply replaced, the applicant respectfully submits that it is not a viable option due to the condition of the existing monument structure and appreciates the board's understanding on this matter. The existing monument structure is what is termed as fake masonry, which is a styrofoam and plaster-based structure. Um, the existing is already shown telltale markers of deterioration um, with cracks, um, the existing skin is pulling away from some part of this, the substructures and cracks are developing and will only get worse. Um, once water gets into these so-called coal monuments that are masonry, there's really no stopping it from starting to deteriorate anymore. Well, I'm going to interrupt you a second. I went over there yesterday and took pictures of the thing. Yeah. And I saw no of what you're saying. We submitted some photos. Uh, you know, so a couple of minor little defects here and there yeah. could be easily fixed. I stopped out my way tonight to the meeting, and I saw the same thing. Yeah. I didn't see any damage to it. I, got, I took photos of it. Um, there were some. Yeah, the other while I was there, <laughs> three, 
three of the residents were wondering what I was doing, standing there taking pictures of their yeah. sign. Okay. And I told them you know, there was an application for a sign change, yeah. and it was this year. Yeah. They were not happy campers. They didn't like their sign. Um, I highly recommend they keep what's there and fix it. It's a beautiful sign. Yeah, it's doing it's a, it's a mad track in Boston. What's that? It's doing it's just doesn't work. No, it's just similar to the other. The only thing that goes is the the fake brick around the sky. I don't love it. It's, it's not a trick at all. The other thing is there's there's no indication of market communities on this sign. So it's not like there's Well, I think it's, I think it's the colorations that they're using and the type of that they're using. They said we were in front of the board here last year with two other Western locations. They're on, they're on post, those other two. What are the two other Western locations? Uh, um, uh, behind Whiteman's. Yeah, behind Whiteman's there's one. Uh, one's Webster. Um, uh, Webster Green. Webster Green. Webster Manor. Yeah, behind. Uh, yeah. And those are the ones that they just go on two singular posts and they're excluded posts. Actually, and there was no there was no problem with it from this board. They um, uh, one of your comments was you know this is a new style sign. Yeah, we're talking yeah, yeah. about that. Yeah. But then earlier you had said that they have had issues where they have changed. In well, the past. well, some of the towns don't like the post look. But that's what so they came. They have a style that the drawing you see right there. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's an identical one to two of them they did in Victor. Victor told them we don't like the, just a double post. You have something with any masonry involved. He said yes. And this is our masonry style one, and it's with you know real stone. It's not similar. Yeah, this is this is this is a fake stone. That's what they're showing. Oh, well, I mean it's stone. It's not. <coughs> it's not a, that water hits the back of that. Those peel right off too. So that's not the greatest the, in the world. The difference may be here. What was there and what's being replaced. And I don't believe the apartments behind Whiteman's or Webster Manor had, you know, as nice of a sign as, as this one. So I don't recall those locations. I, I, I would guess Webster Manor probably had a post sign and it was just replacing the post sign. I, 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 I don't know, I don't remember. But you, you were going from either nothing to a new sign location, or your, which is one thing. Which the sign that you've proposed, if if that came to this board, it it it, it would probably be okay. The difference is, is you're you're downgrading the sign. You're significantly downgrading the sign that's already there. And I, I think I that's can't speak on that because I don't. Right, you know, but I'm I, not the owner. I'm not the. I, and, and I understand, but I, I believe like, is that or is that what other people say? It's just it's significantly downgrading what's there. Yes, yeah. yeah, there's no question there. That's, there was, when, the, when Old Pilot was built, when they came in with that project, one of the things was the sign. There's a lot of traffic along Jackson. Yeah, there. Does, yeah. And actually, on the interior, where the road splits, there's the same type of sign as inside. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm going to assume they're leaving that one. They're replacing both of them. That doesn't make sense to me. They're both, you know, absolutely beautiful signs. They're trying to get away from the big stucco units because they've been problems with them. Well, I, maybe not as much. Maybe not as much here. I've been in the business 40 years, and when those things came out, they looked very pretty for a while. And we've already, from our own customers, we've already replaced a few of them. And we brought masons in and put regular brick in. And Laminated stone on it instead of styrofoam. Yeah. I, I, you know, it's up to the board. My, my opinion, though, I saw, I went over and looked at it, I did not see the damage. Yeah. I know they submitted photographs, and I think we sent them in. We showed a, a variety of those parts where they're starting to deteriorate. I mean, what's the customer's we good to me. What would the customer's recourse be then if, you know, if they get denied and they don't have them, they're only allowed to eat? Can they just Tear that monument down and start again. I mean, that's what they want to do. They want to replace it completely with a new sign. So yeah, they're, I mean, looking, they're looking for direction from the, the town. See, we already we did this the last meeting. We went through this. We well, well, the last meeting, the last meeting, it was like, the last meeting was keep the step on just 
put some new panels on it. Well, they don't want to do that. Well, that's and the new McDonald's want to take down their big golden arch. What, what, would, you, what, what would the board allow? Let's, let's forget that the sign's even there. If I was coming before fresh, let's say that tomorrow they decide the developer is going to redo that entrance and tear that sign down. Here's a fresh application for a sign. Mm -hmm. Would that sign that you're looking at right now be approved by this board? But the one that's existing? No, no. The so one that's existing? Let's say, let's say, let's say a, a truck ran over. Yeah, probably not. We would be looking for something more ornamental on it to be okay. more attractive. So, what do I tell the people in uh, Philadelphia? That they've that got now, what, what do you want now? Did the town of Webster spent a lot of time reviewing Oakmont when yeah. it was originally built? I, I expressed that. Tonight. Looked at this sign, approved it, was very happy with it. The standing is the same. The neighbors are very happy with their sign. Yeah. I, well, I only spoke to three of them that happened to be going by, like I said. But they're very happy with their sign, and they don't want to see just a simple, plain sign there. <coughs> and I think that's where we should stand. So I, 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 need, I need some kind of guidance to give them some design concept. Show them a picture of what exists and say, make this again. That's their approval we gave at the last night. Yeah. And that's what we want. They're, 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 they're going to take it down. I mean, there's no doubt about it. They want to remove it. Well, I'm sure that that's what the, con the contractor's already informed us that they're, they're taking it down. Well, let's, let them take them down. But they're I mean, what, what should them, they Okay, I'll tell you what. Here's the deal. They already got a contract? No, no. no. Go ahead and take the signs down and then just come in with a new plan showing what they want to build. This won't be it, though. But what do we tell them? Then we'll play hardball. What, that's all. No, no, we're not playing hardball. What do I tell the design company that's doing it? What it should look like? Should it just be identical to what's there? No, you're, you're going down a hypothetical. We, well, we've already made a decision. On it's what's there. there. It's what's there. I'm just replacing so I'm just telling the, the, the yeah. stuff with what you got. Yeah. yeah. Just, we, just we, change we their placard. Yeah. 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 Just change their placard. And you do have the address on the end. On the, yeah. Facing the road. That's cool. That's nice. That's good. But the sign, that's, that's, that's why we did this at the last meeting. I'm just, I'm just in between. No, I know. I mean, it's <laughs> you're, you're, you're right to our place right now. We, we've done, like I said, we've, we've done probably 35 of these already. Yeah. And every town has been. Some of them have just been simple. Rubber stamp. You know, one for one, no problem. Yeah. The only ones that made a problem with so far with Victor was Victor. Because they like mas they like masonry bases. I understand that's something. Versus posts. <laughs> they, like, they like a masonry base versus post signs. Yeah. That's all. Yeah. You know, because we went in there and it was on two posts. They said, no, nah. you know, the sign is there is on a brick base. Yeah. Put the new design, the new sign if you have a brick base. We like brick. Or, or masonry. So yeah. that's what that's the concept we used in there. Well, I think that then the guidance should if they want to do a whole new structure, that the structure should be commensurate or nicer than what is already there. We're trying not to go backwards. We want a similar structure with the stone or masonry to what's there. So you're saying to conference the whole sign of masonry work. Like, like the fake, uh, the no, fake the decision we made last time or this Oh, just so I know the top one. Like. So they've already got approval to just put new placards on the existing structure. Yes. So they said, sounds like the board is just sticking with that decision. Yes. That's all I can tell. What, what they have there is a very attractive site. Yeah. It's landscape nice. It's, a, it's, a, it's an extremely beautiful entrance to a, yeah. a project. Yeah. So let's see if we can get them to leave it that way and just change their face. You know, they're lettering and so on inside the sign itself. And and they can they can just post the address right on the face there, sir. And this is not a big deal. No. I got it a whole lot less expensive too. Yeah. I don't understand where they're going. And the neighbors there again, the, the three that came out of there, oh, they, they were like, they don't want to see anything change. We like our sign. Okay. That's serious, that's their words. What do you want to do? You want to 
Well, you've already approved the other, the other decision. Yeah, you've got I'll just go back to the say, hey, and say what they approved the same place. Approved. They don't care if the thing's falling apart or whatever. you got to keep it the way yeah, it is. Yeah, but it's not falling apart. They, 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 they told you stuff. that, they're full of baloney. Well, they sent me pictures. I, I, got, I sent them into the building department. There's a bunch of, you know, around the base it's all cracked and started. It's going right down to the styrofoam, which is exposing the inner core of the material, which is all it is, the styrofoam inside of it. So it's, it wants water. They'd like to put up a new one. They can build a new one in the same <coughs> way that the old one looks, but just use the right materials. Yeah, use, use brick. Yeah, use block of brick. That's, that's what I was thinking. That that's what I just said. said. Just make it look like that. Yeah. You want something that is equivalent to what's there or better, not, we don't want it to go backwards. Well, the, what they're proposing is, is a lot better than, is a lot better than what's existing. I mean, material-wise, that, that stucco monument might have been $4,500. They're dumping $11,000 into the sign. Yeah, a I, very I, expensive I, sign. I, I, and I disrespectfully disagree that the one that's proposed is nicer than what's there. But I'm seeing dollars-wise. I mean, right, anyways, we made a decision on this thing okay. last time. And okay. Unless you want you guys want to vote to change it to this, then there's no sense in continuing the discussion. Okay. All right. I'll just um, pass mine. So we've got to make a decision. Are we going to go to table it um, so you hear from them again, or, or else we just vote? I can just go back to them and say, hey, they're, they're, they're not budging. You have to sit with what you got. All right. Then we'll and, then, and then they take it from there. If they, if they decide they're going to uh, go the next step up. So we either, we, either, we either have to approve, disapprove, or table it. Yeah. You want to table it? What would you? If we deny well, it. Well, you've already given an approval from the last meeting. Yeah, but you're here with another. You got a whole other It doesn't sound like that's going to be approved. Yeah. So we'd actually just be withdrawing that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right, somebody want to make a motion on this? No. I'll make a motion we deny the application as presented. I'll second that. And the applicant stick with the original. Okay, Mr. Kashani. Aye. 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 Mr. Kashani. Aye.